Hey, what's up? Take three of this voiceover because clearly <laughs> this is my first time voicing over my videos. Thought I might as well just switch it up. So here we are. Let's start off with the wellness. Then we'll move on to the self-taught developer. In terms of wellness, my emotions have been all over the place. And yeah, I've been keeping it. Yeah, I've been watching out for the reasons because I noticed that Joe I don't know what's my why do I have such a proclivity towards negative emotions and the certain circumstances so yeah obviously I was breathing and then obviously yeah everything went back to normal but then went back to a negative state and I was like all right cool I need to assess my relationship with pleasure even under the right circumstances, I don't seem to deal very well. I guess when it comes to like a mass of people, especially. I think I have some reasons. But, you know, I guess once I sort out these reasons in terms of where I'm at in life, things will be far better. But, you know, yeah, this is just me accounting for these emotions. I ain't trying to go too deep into it. Besides for that, hey, <laughs> yeah, meditating and breathing really does help. On the other end, hey, today's lesson yeah, is that I shouldn't leave confidence on the table, you know, because I'm practicing morality and know all these different morals. I noticed that I there's a certain level of confidence that I've been granted especially being on this journey so the best thing i could do for myself is to actually you know grab life by the horns and take these small leaps which i did today i only did a session for 135 once nah? but then there weren't any 2.5s and 5 kgs to work with today and i was like all right cool let's go to three plates let's do 140 kgs three by three you know and i managed to do it I won't say that my form is perfect, but I've come to grips that, yo, my form is bound to degrade or deteriorate when I work with heavy weights. So it's pretty much the norm. As long as I don't work too much with my back, which is what happens towards the end of the set. So I'm just there like, Ish, yeah, at least I got this belt. But hey, as time goes on, I'll just practice my form, especially during my deload weeks. But besides for that, I'm good, I'm great. I'm good, I'm great. <laughs> so I was really happy about that. And yeah, I'll definitely stick to 140 for like a week before moving on to 145 and 150. Just to make sure that, hey man, yeah, I've got this down. So I guess my linear progression has not been wasted as much. You know, my linear progression is not done, especially since I keep on gaining weight. But I'm just trying to... I just aim to have fun with this, you know, experiment and not be too strict with it. Because on some days when my form is off, I know that I cool. Let me just stick at it. But on some days, it's like, all right, let me just see if I can do the next weight. And yeah, I'm probably not going to be squatting as much because your, your boy's legs are huge. Yeah, let me just say I'm pleased with their size right now. So I'm not going to be doing hypertrophy, hyper, hypertrophy training as much. I'd rather do strength training, you know, especially the high I go. Make sure I'll just be doing three by threes and at times four by three, five by three, depending, depending. Yeah. So that's what's up. That's what's up. That's my stance. And yeah, I guess this will apply to a lot of other things that I'm doing in life when it comes to that. So I'm pretty glad at this point in time with where I'm at in terms of exercise. Mm -hmm. One thing that's been troubling me are these headaches that I've been getting because you're I'm not sure if it's the amount of pressure or my sinuses, but around my eyes, I have this impeccable headache. But I, as time goes on, we'll just see what's up. We'll just see what's up. And that's all for today. Thank you for checking the wellness series.